All right, I gotta make sure everything is still good with the stream before we start. I think we're almost ready to go. I think we're, I think this is fine. I'm hoping the audio's okay. I'm gonna go ahead and start recording. All right, hey everybody. Um, we're back from uh, our previous adventures of driving trucks, and now we are going to build a giant factory. Um, I did participate in the satisfactory early release weekend or alpha weekend or what it was a couple weeks ago. Um, and I just wanted to, I guess, I didn't think there was going to be anything special about the new, um, release today, but apparently looking at their release notes, there's a whole bunch of new content that they added, so that's awesome. Um, I really, really liked the game a lot, and I would highly recommend it to anyone that's into Factory Sims or Tycoon games or whatever. Um... All right, actually, hold on. I do need to fix one thing real quick. Um, 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 um. Settings. Okay, cool. Alright, now. No, I really am ready this time. Okay, here we go. Alright, and recording in 3, 2, 1. Alright, hey everybody, we are back um, from doing our truck stream, and now we are here with Satisfactory. Um, it's been kind of a while, uh, I guess a couple weeks since I played the Alpha Weekend. Um, it was, you know, a lot of fun, but there wasn't a whole lot of content there. I think I managed to get my way through it in about six hours. Um, having said all that, I read the release notes for the actual release today, and it looks like there is a whole bunch of new content, so it seems like it'd be something that I should definitely play. Um, I played Grass Fields last time, and it was really cool, but I think... It, they didn't have either of these options. Um, I think Northern Forest might be fun to, to start in. Building is harder, but biomass is a common resource. That sounds good to me, because... Well, it wasn't hard at all to find biomass in the grass fields, but... I don't know. Let's go for a change of pace or something. Yeah, yeah. Offline session, please. I'm not playing with anyone today. Hey, Tony Stack, how's it going? Starting satisfactory, you came right at a good time. I just pressed the start button. So we are, uh, we are just starting. And I'm going to land in my little pod. I'm gonna go pick up my neat little flashlight there. Yeah, I'd like to get out. Oh, let me 
drop the music volume a bit. That's better. Oh, I'm supposed to explore and exploit. Yep, sounds about right. Um, Tony Stack, Star Traders was really good. I did uh, end up getting crippled at the end. It was not um, not as glorious as I was hoping for a, a stream, but it was a good learning experience. Planetfall, yes, that's what I want. This would be a pretty sweet game in uh, VR, I think. Yep. 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 This is pretty sweet. Like, even the boxes jiggle. That's This is just awesome. This is such a... Just an epic start. Probably not as good as maybe, like... Oh, Star Commander. Not Star Commander. Um... Oh, I'm blinking on the name. This is... Not good. Star... Star... That ridiculously cool one that's been in development for way too long and is still in alpha and I haven't actually played it. Spaceships. Lots of spaceships. Anyway, that had an awesome, awesome introduction. It'll hit me in the middle of this. Oh, wow, there's a big old... I wonder if there's going to be different animals on this planet. I'm going to see if I can change the audio, boost it at all. Okay. Alright. I think I can safely... Yay! I lived! Hey, big donkey mo monster. Oh yeah, I have to dismantle that. Yeah, right. This thing does absolutely nothing. Where's the iron? Oh my gosh, there's no iron within scanning range? Seriously? Alright, let's try this again. Oh, oh, there we go. Only 700 meters away. Alright. Um, yeah, that thing over there, those are grumpy. Those things you want to avoid. Oh, I haven't even seen this thing yet. What are you? You're a weird bird. Well, that wasn't special. You didn't even give me anything. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of weird landing on a planet and the first thing you do is kill a weird bird monster, but you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just gonna... Give me all your leaves. Give me the biomass. I need to... Alright, so... I need to ping iron again, because I don't see how... Oh, yeah. No. Gotta get away from the poison plants. Uh... Oh, yeah. Gotta turn off my ad blocker, too. Or not ad blocker, uh... Uh-oh. Huh. 
Huh, my antivirus does not like this game for some reason. Whatever. Um, as long as it saves. Alright, uh, let's see, let's see. Uh, ping again. Where was the iron? Because... I appear to have hit the end of the world over to here. How is there possibly iron over there? There's a huge... Not part of the world over here. Wait, what? Seriously? No, I don't want to go down there. No, where's the other? There's got to be some... Okay, so we're going to go to this 600, 800, whatever, meter one. I am really hoping we don't run into one of those weird dogs, because they're not friendly. Oh, yep, yeah, spoke too soon. Hey, grumpy dog. You know what? I'm just going to run away from you. Oh, dang it! Yay! I'm flying! <laughs> Alright. 720. Here we go. Here we go. 600. 600 meters. Alright. Gotta avoid dog monsters. Wish there was like some sort of indicator that these critters were on... Uh-oh. Oh, what? Okay, yeah, I haven't seen that guy. That's... No! You've got to be kidding me. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, this is not good at all. Leave me alone. Oh no! <laughs> I uh, don't have high hopes right now. It's seeming like most of the iron is not in this bio area, and I would really, really like something here. I do not want to have to go down into the... whatever that area was. If I remember right, these guys are mostly passive? Uh, yeah. Well, I'm going to have to find something or somewhere soon, because I am basically out of... I'll be running pretty low on health here soon. Okay, this this iron source looks like it's potentially on the on the same biome that I'm in. Yeah, so I'm I'm grabbing all these leaves right now because they're about the if I remember right, they're about the only early fuel source you get. Um, eventually you can unlock coal and stuff. Um, yeah, Tony Stack, good question. Um, so, I don't know if you've ever played Factorio, um, but this game is... Like, it's very, very hard to describe this game without describe or comparing it to Factorio. Um, I don't feel like I'm on an iron source right now. Um, so basically what you're trying to do is build a factory, like automate some sort of factory or something, but... Um, yeah, initially you're just trying to build up enough iron so you can actually build some sort of um, initial basic automation. Spacious. Okay. Uh, Q hub. We would like to place this somewhere not in a tree, because last time I did manage to place it inside of a tree, and that was really annoying. All right.
mission to the next objective. Okie doke. Um, tier zero of upgrade one. We would like to do this. Uh, we, I think we, yeah, we just have to start it. Um, we need ten iron rods. And yeah, we have all these little bits and bobs. I don't think we have a chest yet. So that's not great, but... Alright, we need iron rods. We need to build... I guess we have to do it... We have to make iron ingots first. Hum to dum. Alright, so right now we're trying to build out... Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I wish there was some... I wonder if any of these could actually be used for healing. Iron ore... Fuel, fuel, color. Yeah, this isn't good. I I know there are plants that can heal you, but I have no idea where they are. And I'm on the verge of dying, so I should get, get this done quick. Okay, so we need to make 10 iron rods, I believe. That was all we needed for tier zero. Sweet. All right, there we go. All right, I can store everything in here now. So I will very... I'm thinking of a very likely chance I'm going to die. Uh, Tony Sack, how's the volume? Alright, um... Power poles, yeah, we definitely need this one, and we need... Iron, iron, and copper, so... Got the iron right here. Alright, I can't remember if auto miners need... So... I need to make some auto miners, but I don't think they use fuel. Maybe they do. I can't remember what kind of fuel they would use. But yeah, let me just get 50 more iron just to be safe. All right. All right. Okay, we'll make all the iron ingots we need, and then I think, yeah, we gotta go find a copper source, that's, that's gonna be the next thing. Oh. Alright, yeah, so we're gonna have to go out scouting in a little bit, but for now, let's see what we need. Well, first of all... Put everything back in there, except I do want my iron. Uh, okay, what can I make here? Um, so which one is this? This is a crafting bench. We need to make the equipment workshop. Iron, six iron plates and six iron rods. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right, now let's try that again. So we do need the equipment workshop, I believe. 
Uh, portable miner. Oh, shoot, it needs copper. Okay, so yeah, we absolutely need to go find some copper now. That's that's kind of a bummer. Um, I'm going to drop all my iron in here in case I... Well, not even in case. In the very likely chance that I die. Although, sorry, what was the other thing I could build? The smelter? Yeah, I can put ingots in there, but it's not a miner, so that doesn't help much. Okay, so... Let's uh, ping again. I think all we're finding is iron. Let's try running a little further south. And hope. Oh, sorry, no. What was it? I need to... I forgot. Yeah, I need to switch the, uh, the scanning. There we go. Okay, so that's not very far away. 120 meters. Now, I don't know if their simulation of limestone. Neat. Cool, so we actually have stone, copper, and iron very close by. This is super convenient. This is a... Uh so limestone's used in cement, I believe, which is used in some of the later uh, buildings that we're going to need to make in the factory. All right. Oh, it's right next to another one of those annoying dogs. Alright. Yum. Uh, what was the other one that had healing properties? This guy? Yum. 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 Alright. And now we should equip the weapon again. Unfortunately, my copper source is up here by one of these stupid dogs. Oh, cool. I got more berries. there's a way to sneak up. Also, I wish there was a gun. So this guy's a jerk. Come here, puppy. Well, that was sort of anticlimactic. I thought I was supposed to get some sort of armor or something from it when I killed it, but who knows. Alright, got my copper. Alright, there we go. There's the carapace. carapace. God, this is actually kind of a pretty area. It's super purple... guys. They actually heal pretty well, apparently. And we'll be able to do research on some of these things that we found later on. And I mean, again, in the Alpha the alpha Weekend, the, um, what was it? The, sorry, I'm losing my train of thought trying to run, make sure there's no critters coming to get me at the same time. Yeah, in Alpha Weekend, there wasn't really that much you could research. Like, research sort of seemed like a thing that you could start doing, but didn't really help. Um, I'm hoping there's a lot more we can do with it now. Alright, I'm um, going to go back over here, drop off the wood, flowers. I guess we should drop one of these off. So we have the copper, we have all the limestone. I don't think we'll be able to do anything with the limestone, but we can make the copper into copper stuffs. So, get 53 copper ingots, that's good for now.
I think I need to close the window because I'm pretty sure the mic is picking up the something garbage truck outside. Probably garbage truck outside. So yeah, hold on one sec. Gonna. <laughs> I think that should be a lot better. All right, um, so we got the copper. We're definitely gonna wanna make a whole bunch of these wires. All right, and then I think we needed something like 10 cable. Just make 20 just in case. All right, next hub is 10, 10, 50. Uh, where's the iron? Uh, so 10 plates, 10 bars, or rods. Sweet. New buildings, new parts, new scannable resources. Player upgraded. Cool. All right. So I think Yes, thank you, but Yes, yes, I know, but wait, I don't, I seriously don't get miners with this? Alright, yeah, I see the bars, but, oh, there we go, there's the miners. Uh, I'm gonna need, oh, it's locked because I have to do three. Oh, great. Alright, let's finish this one up then real quick. Um, oh, wait, we can build auto miners. Yeah, let's just do some auto miners then. You're over here? No. Over here. Yes. Portable miners. Um, so we need some iron plates. There we go. Alright, so let's build what? We need at least three. One. Two. Three. Alright. Oh, here's the research, I think. No, it's not the research. Well, the research will be in here. Um, and a couple more upgrades. And for now, we just have one biomass burner and uh, don't need to... I don't think I need to put anything in there right now, but I don't think there's any problem if I do. So I'll just drop some... Leafs. Wow, it's dark. Okay, so, um, auto miner. Oh no, I don't want a power pole. Want... There we go. Hey, buddy. Why don't you go mine a little bit? Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Alright, next. And finally, we're gonna need one more. Make sure I have my weapon equipped still. we go so we got all three miners down I don't remember if they need fuel or not yeah they don't sweet all right so we'll go run back oh no oh good yes run away I don't want to fight you either Alright. Give me all 
flat stone. And give me all that iron. So we got a bunch of raw resources. Gonna need to make ingots and concrete. Probably gonna need more concrete than that, but this should be enough iron and potentially enough copper for a while. Should definitely be enough uh, wire. Oi. So I think right now I need to get enough concrete. So yeah, I should probably run back, grab all the limestone after I'm done um, refining all of these, make a bunch of concrete, and then uh, should be good to go after that. Oh yeah, biomass. And concrete. Alright, let's go get the limestone. Where to go? It was over here, right? I think. See if we can get a hundred. There we go. Plenty enough. So yeah, let's go make some concrete. Then that should be enough for the next upgrade. And then I think we'll be able to get miners after that here there we go All right, 75 plates 10 cables 10 concrete two reinforced iron plates so I believe that's iron and concrete 75 iron plates. Reinforced iron plate is screws, which are iron rods. Okay. So we've got 30 of those, which make plenty of screws. And then we just need to make two of these. And then 75 iron plates. Oh, we might need more iron. Yeah, cool. All right. All right. Slowly but surely. Yeah, I mean, we, we could create machines, but honestly, it's like... <sighs> At least early game, it seems like it's a lot faster to handcraft these things. Having some of these things automated would be nice. I should probably set up with a couple smelters, but um, I, I really just like getting the miners set up and then move from mining into smelting. So you can get, uh, you can directly get your... needed stuff so okay um okay got my two reinforced plates uh got my got eight of my ten cables make a couple more cables plates concrete so we need just a few more iron plates and we're up on the next one There we 
go. Hub upgraded. Four. Needs more cable. Iron, iron. So yeah, we're gonna need to go get some more copper. Yes. Yes, and that is why I don't really want to do it because those generators don't do a whole heck of a lot and I don't want to have to worry about rebuilding a bunch of stuff a second time. I'm just going to do it the first time. <gasps> Ooh, he's just dancing in the water. I've never actually been in the water. Oh, you can swim. That's convenient. Yeah, I don't think I explored very much at all during the Explorer weekend. I just wanted to build a factory, which I felt like I did pretty well. There we go. Apparently you can't climb out easily, so that's something else to know. Man, I can't... This game is just going to be so sweet later on. I mean, it's not bad now, but it's just going to be so much better. Okay, I can't do anything yet. Okay, just for fun, why don't we set up one smelter to do iron? Uh, oh, cool, I can do foundations? Well, that's even better. Let's set up our factory... Right over here. Oh man, need more concrete. I forgot how expensive those things were. Yeah, so we can start setting up a factory floor. That's neat. We should probably set up another limestone auto miner, but I don't really even know if it's worth it. I'm going to be... Actually, wait, didn't I just finish up getting miners? No, almost there. That's what this next level up is all about. Getting actual miners so I can set up an actual production flow. Alright. Um, concrete, that's what I need. Concrete, concrete. Focus, focus. Alright. All right, there we go. Come back over here. Build another couple platforms. Actually, no, whatever, we don't need that. We can just do the smelter right here. Oh, iron rods. Iron rod. Okay. So we come right here. Set up our smelter. Uh, how do we rotate it? Oh, just roll the mouse wheel. Excellent. Yeah, there we go. Power pole. Actually, I probably didn't even need that. Let me... F. Yeah, we don't even need that there. I'm pretty sure cable will just work from... There to there. Oh yeah, missing cables. Okay, so let's come back here. <clears throat> um, iron ingots. And then we need copper ingots too, so let's just make a few of these. Um, get a bunch of wire get a bunch of kale. That should be enough for now. From the power plant to... Actually, no, we should build one power pole just so we can split the line across a few smelters. Let's 
build one more smelter. Any devs ever watch this, another really nice quality of life control would be the ability to have this thing not automatically spawn on <laughs> or not clip into another one where you're trying to lay down a blueprint. Um, foundations. Let's build one more. Okay, um, and then up here, I think what we can do is. Logistics, don't want either of those. Do we have any storage yet? I don't think so. Yes, this is really weird. This feels kind of strange to me why you would have all these options to build conveyor belts and stuff, but not actually have any of the miners set up or anything. Kind of tedious. Um, and not have storage, you know, ability to actually run anything in here, so whatever. Two. There we go, and we'll just set you up to make iron, we'll set you up to make copper, and then we'll set one more up. Yeah, I don't think we can make automatically make concrete yet, I don't think. Yeah. Pretty sure we can't. Nice little watering area. There we go. Grab all my copper. We can grab all the iron ore and then dump it back into the smelters. Oh, there's one of those energy slugs up there. I should go grab that. Not really necessary yet, but... So up there's a... There, that glowing thing, that's a some sort of energy slug. and. Uh, when you research them, uh, they give you the ability to enhance your your machines, um, kind of like the oh, what are they called in Factorio? The mods or whatever, so you can make your machines go faster. I think at the expense of more energy, but speed is usually good at a certain point. Uh, let's see, drop copper. And drop iron. Should take all the uh, ingots. And then we'll go over here. Actually, we should go make some biomass with all these leaves I've been picking up. Wow, I really picked up a lot of leaves. Alright, cool. Uh, go over here. Um, I think we can just throw most of those in there. Leaves, wood, flowers. Um, the rest of these I think we can just keep in my inventory for a while. And then you, make sure you're all loaded up. Okay. Um, so let's go make some iron plates and iron rods. This is kind of tedious. <laughs> Hand smelting these. I really don't want to get into the automation part until we're a little further along than we are now. Alright, um, still just iron rods and iron plates. 
So let's go back over to Auto Miner. Grab you. Run you back over to the Iron Smelter. Drop you in there. So we get the rest of my copper ore in there. Okay, so up on the top right, it looks like we need 59, 59 iron plates. Yeah, so our smelters are taking their own sweet time, so we're unfortunately going to have to handcraft quite a few ingots. Humdy dum. install some sort of mod that just automatically holds my left button down or left mouse button down until I press something to deactivate that plenty enough iron plates. Just need a whole bunch of iron rods. Oh, we can actually make them up, or make enough. Upgrade. Yeah, this is the one that automation is almost necessary. Because 500 and 150 of each of these is kind of difficult. Alright, let's see if there's a second iron spot somewhere close by. Is this another iron spot? Oh, cool it is! Good stuff. Yeah, so it's a little bit buggy. That it pinged but showed it being a slightly different place, but... Oh, well, whatever. Okay, here. Um, we definitely want to build a miner. Um, have it face this way. And we definitely need enough iron rods to do that. So um, let's go over here. Collect this bit of iron. Back away, trees. Okay, so we'll go over here. Actually, no, let's, let's just drop it in the smelters if we can. Um, we got all this, here's a bunch of iron, uh, I don't think I have any more copper ore, but I don't really need any, so why don't we switch you to iron for now, and you can take the other bunch, and I think I'll just grab whatever's here, and restock this right smelter, there we go, okay, now, now we've got all that, Let's go make a... <clears throat> Bunch of iron rods. Okay, so what, what else does the miner require? Concrete. And an auto miner. Okay, so... Let's go make another auto miner over 
few auto miners, or portable miners. So we need one, two, three, four of these. Actually, wait. Maybe we can just make all the stuff for the final hub upgrade. Actually, yeah, maybe we'll, <laughs> I'll just handcraft this last little bit. I know it's kind of... It'll be really annoying to watch, but... It's more annoying to do it. Got all the copper, and the iron bars, iron plates. Yeah, so we're definitely going to want to drop another couple. Uh, where'd they go? Let's see. And then the final one. There we go. So we got all the iron we need. I should probably go get the rest of that copper ore over there. Should I take the time to set up a miner? Nah, not yet. Um, let's see, iron plates. We're gonna need 150 iron plates and 150 iron bars. So that's three, 450 iron ingots, I think. Four hundred fifty sounds about right. Cool. All right. I'll drop these in here, and we need to go get all this iron ore. Don't think the smelters have done much. Yeah, thirty-six. Looks like we'll be doing quite a bit of hand smelting. Make sure we got enough gas. Yeah, it looks good. What are we at? Consuming 8, producing 20, so that's fine. We got enough energy for now. Maybe we could actually create one more smelter just for fun. Of course, we don't have any iron bars. Or rods. I keep seeing bars. There we go. be another iron. There we go. Three smelters producing a bunch of iron and a bunch of iron ore. And you know what? I'm gonna go grab the limestone and copper wallow. I'm taking my time here. Hoi! biomass soon too. But I'm positive I have plenty enough uh, 
leaves. I think I do want to go run up there and try to get that power slug. Well, I guess I don't really need it until we can actually use it to research, so at least I know where one is. Um, pick you up, drop you off. Pick you up, drop you off. up drop you off all right and now the awful tedium of handcrafting all this stuff Whoa. <clears throat> For the recipe, some biomass from the wood. Which biomass you got in you? Oh, you're still pretty good, but top you off. need 30 concrete, which I think we have. Let's just drop everything that is needed in here. So we need the rods and the plates, and that's it. Um, plates, we need not many more. 23, 22, 23. Is that right? Yeah. And then... <clears throat> 105 rods. There we go. I should make a few more rods just because I always seem to need them and run out of them. 30 should be enough. All right. Final upgrade, here we are. Yeah, so I think the hub's completed. You have unlocked hub feature, molecular analysis machine, also known as the MAM. Building biomass burner, building space elevator, equipment object scanner, equipment beacon. Yeah, so message. Congratulations. You succeeded in every provided task. On behalf of Fixit Incorporated, I thank you for your current and future service. Additional knowledge. The hub terminal has been converted to give access to milestones there to ensure you progress along Fixit approved protocol. Why thank you, weird robot. Cool. So we got the hub set up, and now we need to get the elevator. So yeah, it took about an hour to get that hub set up. Not bad. Probably could optimize it, but... Okay, there's all the iron. Hmm. 
Okay, and I think that's all the basic machines. So that's constructor, smelter, and miner. Um, power. We do have a biomass burner, finally. Um, so we don't need to use those two weird engines on the front of my hub. Basic. Um, logistics, basic. Foundations. Oh, cool, we finally got the storage container. Perfect. Okay, so what I really like to do... Okay, so yeah, we're going to need some iron plates, about 30 iron plates. Um, so what I like to do is build three containers and just fill them with the raw ore and then, or the raw plates and then dump them into a machine or vice versa. Just feed the smelters directly in. But yeah, I think we're almost at the point, I think we're at the point now where we can do the basic level of automation that I enjoy. So let's go to foundations, build another big old foundation here. First things first, I think we should set up um, concrete automation. It shouldn't be too hard. Do I still? No, I don't still have the auto miners in there. I actually use them as auto miners. Silly me. Okay, I'm gonna go take my. What? Equipment workshop. I'll build a portable miner or two or one because I don't have enough cable. Yeah, I think we only need that one for now. So we'll go over, check what the miner takes. Q will need concrete. So we'll go make that. And hopefully this will be the last time I have to handcraft concrete. But for now... Uh, oh, we should make some more copper ingots so I can make more wire, which will make more cable. some cable. Maybe some iron plates. Alright, um... We'll head over here. Drilling away. Good for you, auto miner. Portable miner. Pick you up. And then I'm going to point you thusly. Thusly. Our first miner. Oh, so beautiful. I can't wait to chop down some of these trees. The man has completed its analysis. Okay, good. Go drop in another research project while we're waiting. And I gotta redo the power too, so might as well break this apart and get all my cable. Yeah, because we gotta rework the power, because um, yeah, both of these biomass generators are probably gonna be needed for now. I don't wanna build any of the standalone ones if I can help it. Just because I'd rather get to coal, but that's gonna take uh, the space elevator. I don't know if I'll be able to get that all done. Okay, so here's the miner. Let's get the miner into. The miner will pump out limestone. And then from the limestone, I need.
does... Oh, this is the part where I forget. Do... All right, we're already known that the smelters can't do um, concrete, so I'm wondering if the... Uh, the constructor does, so I think I need some reinforced iron plates, which is screws that I'm running low on, so I'll make some more of those. Make some more iron rods, because I'll definitely need some more of those. And then make one, two, three, whatever, I'll just make as many as I can hold. Alright, I should also see if I can clear up my inventory while I'm next to my crate here. Wood. I think that's good. I'll drop in. Yep, and then run one more project. didn't catch that. I don't understand. Okay, um... Tier 1 Utility, Biofuel Lookout Tower, Logistics, Splitters and Mergers, those are both really good, but uh, another chest, um, Object Scanner Berries, Assemblers, modular frames. There's the chainsaw, but mm, I think that's super expensive. Eh, I can probably afford it. But yeah, let's go down to here first and try to build a Well, okay, first let's just start it up. Because no matter what, we're going to need to store any of this concrete. So let's just get some, or sorry, limestone. So let's get the storage container set up. There we go. I think this is input. I hope this is input. Alright, so, storage container, and then let's go build a few power poles. Get the power from up above down here. Here's one. Here's two. Here's three. And let's get some wires set up, so you're going to need to be connected to there, you're connected to there, you're connected to there, and you're connected to there. You're connected here. Alright, so you've started. Cool. So you're going to produce a bunch of limestone. It should be dumped into here, and that means that I can probably dump all my limestone in there. Alright, cool. Limestone's going. We're moving. We're moving. Oh, cool. One of these flowers that I can't take somehow, for some reason. I think we might have to switch the music though, because this is starting to drive me a little bit crazy. So, uh, uh, let's do. Maybe we can do this. Uh, 
Sure, why not? Okay, um... So let's see. Got concrete going, or at least the limestone. We want to get the... Actually, do we really need the obstacle clearing done? I think tier one will probably be more useful, um, especially with the lookout. Well, lookout tower is sort of neat. Bio feels the best thing in there. Logistics splitters and mergers don't need either of those just yet. Um, yeah, don't need any conveyor walls. Actually, jump pads were the only thing I didn't play around with. So maybe I'll try doing that at some point. But yeah, yeah, I think the chainsaw is going to be the most help here. Oh, well, yeah. So we'll go do the chainsaw. But I want to get my smelters up and running. I can also... No, I do need the merger. So I'm thinking what I... Or right, right now what I'm thinking is I could merge the output from all three of these smelters into a single um, storage container. And then at least that point I'd have a large supply of iron I could go to. Um, but again, I would like to have the iron output from here into those three. Uh, yeah, let's, let's, let me just focus on getting this chainsaw done first. Why am I handcrafting these? Alright, so... Bunch of iron rods. And then it looks like just a fair amount of copper after that. So maybe we should set up another miner for the copper. Running power that far is going to be kind of annoying, though. Eh. Maybe we can set up another biomass generator out there. Okay, I need some more iron rods. Yeah, I think we're going to have to run the power out there, because I really don't want to have to deal with two different power plants. Or two different areas where we have power being produced. So we'll go back over here. I need a bunch more wire, a bunch more cable. Guess we might might as well burn through this entire stack of ore.
one of the weird things about copper is I think it only there's only one thing that you can craft copper into or copper ingots into which is wire so when I was doing production last time it was actually just an immediate mining to smelting to production of wires and then I stored the the wires I didn't try to store any of the copper ingots because I didn't feel like there'd be any use for it all right um should be able to run power now. Oh, no, never mind. Hold on. We need cable. Cable. Alright, there we go. Alright, now we can run power out to the copper field. top of the miner and build a storage container oh my god you're kidding me I'm one plate short can I make a <laughs> crafting bench out here oh look at that Make sure we have enough of these for a little bit. All right. There we go. Storage. Copper ore, I think we should be good now. So we will take the power, power the miner, producing copper. Excellent. Um, let's see if we can make the concrete now, since we're kind of down here and, and sort of do that. Um, constructor. stupid plate. Alright, so we need to go get make some <sighs> make some reinforced plates. Which I need to open a whole bunch of screws for. Constructor. You can make concrete, perfect. Okay, you to you. And then just need some power.
And then we will have the concrete feed into another storage bin. Okay, we actually have no more iron plates. This is annoying. All right, um, we're gonna come over here, make a few iron plates. And then we're gonna go grab all of our iron or rather start manufacturing some more iron ingots and then change one of these smelters to copper so we can get enough copper too. So you'll be my copper guy. You'll be iron guy still and more iron, there we go. Okay, now let's go build the storage. Concretes. Okay, now we got all the copper flowing into here. We should probably build a copper smelter and then constructor. Can we do that? There we go. And then from here, can we build a... Can we force this into storage? I'll just stand right up here. This looks safe. Yeah, immediately con construct um, wire. And then store all the wire. <laughs> Stupid iron plates. Alright. Um, maybe, yeah, maybe we should just leave. We've had this happen enough times. So maybe we should just leave a crafting bench over here. So maybe we'll do like 30 or 40. Maybe 50 of these plates just to make sure we're not going to run out again. All right, now, let's try this again. Storage. There we go. Okay, so we got all the wires being automated. How's our power doing? Okay, so we're still only consuming 17 megawatts, which is great. Um, with all of that being done, actually, is this going to be sufficient? That's what I'm curious. Are we going to have a backup here? Is this producing faster than it's... 
No, it's producing actually at the exact same rate. So copper's coming in roughly at the rate it's producing. Then how long is it taking? Oh yeah, it's definitely backing up here. So we should have a buffer for the copper ingots. Which unfortunately is going to mean that I'm going to need to take you down real quick. Better do this now before you run out of inventory space. Alright, so. Smelter. We're going to build another storage container. I'm hoping that's sort of even. It's really hard to tell. Close enough. Alright, <clears throat> then from here, maybe we should start turning it. Maybe a little bit this way. There we go, okay. We got our concrete storage done. We got our copper wires done. And how is my inventory looking for wires? Pretty good. We'll have to do iron in a little bit, but I'd like to get a splitter first. Splitter set up first, which I wanna do after. I get chainsaws so I can start clearing all the trees away before we start getting really into um, really into the planning for the the setup for the factory. Okay, here we go. screws Let's build some reinforced plates. Maybe we need to make some more screws too. Of course, we're running out of iron plates. Entire copper supply. Copper by itself isn't super helpful. I'm gonna build some wires. Maybe 40 of them, 40 or 50 of them. Alright, here we go. And I just realized. Just realize we probably need biofuel to uh, to actually use it. So we should make sure we <laughs> research that first. All right, 150 iron plates, 150 iron bars, and 500 copper. So let's go take all the iron, iron, 
copper. Iron ore, iron ore, iron ore. Should go down and grab some more wire if we can. I don't think we need any concrete yet. You. Oh, I can't drop anything in even for three minutes. Okay, well, whatever. Um. So yeah, we're gonna need to manufacture a whole bunch of stuff, and I guess while we're waiting for the pod to get back, maybe we should just set up the iron mining and refinery. I think that'll just be a bit easier, or make my life a bit easier at least. So I can't remember the exact ratios But I believe, oh, whoops. I can't remember the exact ratios, but I believe one miner can power at least two, if not three smelters. just pipe all of this into one until we get splitters. So, minor. And we will have all of the iron. Drop into storage, but let's set up a proper area for that. This is where we're going to need that concrete finally. Yeah, building on the side of a Mountain is not easiest. I think it's good enough. All right, rotate this. Yes, I want to put the ramp right here. Why can't I put the ramp here? Milestone exchange completed. Fix it, crater reentry complete. There we go.
And since we're only going to be running one for real for now, we might as well only plug one in. No point in running all three. Okay. Storage container. go. Yeah, that's a heck of a lot of iron ore that's, um, what is this? 120 per minute. And each one of these smelters can do 30 per minute. Wow, so I could four smelters. So yeah, we absolutely need to get splitters to make this more as, as efficient as possible. But for now, let's try to get um, the basics done here. Just make a bunch of iron rods, which we need to go get a bunch of iron, which we're now smelting, so that should be okay. We should check on biomass, because I don't know how much fuel the generators have. Guys, looking. Yeah, you could use a touch up. One, two. You and uh, let's pull all these leaves out of here. Just turn it all into biomass. I think there's a possibility we may run out of inventory room before we finish these because I believe there's more biomass created than leaves used. A stack of leaves is 500 and biomass is only 200. Or maybe it's one to one, but yeah, either way, you create more stacks of biomass than you do with leaves. Chainsaw uh, is almost good. All right, let's go get the copper wire. And I think we have enough direct or raw resources for everything we need. While I'm thinking about it, why don't we make one more smelter? Since it looks like we will be able to do four smelters with one mine. And of course we don't have the iron rods.
iron plates. We can convert biomass to biofuel now. Yeah. Once we get the splitters, I think we'll be able to do. We'll be able to have a sufficient amount of. Should have a su sufficient amount of automation to build the um, the sky elevator, space elevator that you just mentioned. All right, chainsaw, screws, and reinforced plates. and screws. Should be enough for the chainsaw. And that should be able to equip it. is pretty awesome and uh, maybe clean up some of the stuff around here is this tree invincible I think it's an invincible tree Sorry, pretty trees, but I need the space. Oh, well, that freaked me out. I don't think I've saved my game in a while. Or at all. coverage so let me it'll be a lot easier to sort of envision what I want the factory to be if it's clear around here all right so the pods back which means that I think That's gonna get annoying. This thing's pretty big. Like, what did I just pay? What do I have in my inventory? Is that all? That is all iron ore. Oh, that's not fun. I can't do anything with it because I don't. I forgot to put storage in front of the four. Oh, what do you call them? The four smelters. So I'm just gonna drop. You off, you off, you and you, 
And I'll go do the research for the mycelia things that I found. So, we just need a bunch, a whole mess, of iron plates, so I'm gonna <laughs> probably have to handcraft all of these ingots. Because I'm too lazy to go back and plug in those three smelters that are there. Laziness is waning. I'm gonna be. Yeah, I think it's gonna be even more easy just to plug <laughs> these guys in. There you go. There you go. Can't do anything with that. I'll just drop you in here then. Even though you're not plugged in and whatever, I'll plug you in. Alright, how are we doing for power? Oh no. <laughs> yep, we ran out of power. So that means we're gonna need another power plant. Another biomass generator, right. Probably right here is fine. Um, you to here, and then you out, then we need you to connect there, you to connect there. Wait, unless you ran out of, no, you didn't run out of biomass, okay, good. I'm going to dump my biofuel in here. Here and you'll sort of be a central place to plug things in. All right, I think everything should be fine. So let's restart. What is our consumption looking like? Oh, cool. Okay, yeah, not bad. We're good for plants until we start building more things. So yeah, right around 60 megawatts is, is fine. Um, come to the bench. So let's build a bunch of plates. get some more iron. There we go. So we need 135 iron plates. And once we get logistics, we can add, I think at that point, you're, we're actually able to do with a full automated setup of almost everything.
with the wires and hopefully there'll be more iron probably not enough iron manufactured but Let's see there we go yeah that's enough wire just need logistics just 100 more iron rods There we go, this should be enough iron to complete this so we can get logistics. Perfect. Yep, so just need a hundred more iron or iron rods and we're logistically sound. the next milestone personal storage would be convenient tier two assemblers walkways are pretty f convenient not really necessary let's do part assembly first okay so We need All right, let's just climb up here and sort this out. So we're going to need to do four, so that means we're going to need two different splitters. So we'll do one splitter right here. And the other splitter kind of right here. Well, of course we don't have enough iron plates. Ain't that just the way it is? I'm gonna need a whole bunch of those iron plates and then we can get iron plate manufacturing set up so I never have to manufacture another one that'll be so nice so nice that that is my dream right now okay into here and oh I need I need to chainsaw these stupid plants down unless they're invincible which it kind of oh cool they aren't I actually kind of like the idea of having four storage boxes for each of these because that kind of gives me 
a little more wiggle room on what I can do with um, what I can potentially do with different iron things like maybe have one or two feed into no I don't need this out I can have one or two feed into I don't know maybe rod or um, plate production Actually, I think there's only two things you can make with iron, so... So never mind. Maybe we'll only have two. the one I wanted to do. There we go. So we'll get a merger. Put it right here. And another merger right there. And that will let us put you to you. Oh crud, I'm running out of plates again. bane of my existence. Do I have any iron? Sorry, iron. Do I have any iron? Not really, so let's just go pull out of here. Out of here. Here. And here. One thing that was really nice with Factorio was handcrafting. Not having to go to a workbench for absolutely everything was nice. I'm imagining that if or when someone makes a mod for this game, that'll probably be one of the first things. So we have all four feeding in, and then we just need all four pulling out. Too steep. Oh, that's not cool. Yeah, that would just drive me crazy if they weren't lined up. There we go. Just for fun, how expensive is the space elevator? Oh, it's not too bad. I mean, the the wire requirement is insane, but no, not otherwise, not too bad. All right. Um, 
I'm gonna try to do something I didn't do last time because I just let this sprawl all across the dirt and maybe this time I can actually try to do walls. So it's concrete and iron plates. Uh, really? get some more concrete and then I think we can build out a few more platforms of course we can So if I, I guess what I'm just can't figure out is how you actually build a ceiling. Do I need to build two walls and then, or a wall on top of another, and then I can build a ceiling on top of that? Okay, that sort of works. This is not going to win the beautiful factory of the year, but it'll get the job done. Can I do a ramp right up here? And then maybe another ramp. Let's see, can we do a big old fat foundation underneath there? And then maybe another smaller ramp right there. Or no, right there. There we go. Alright, I made it up here. Sweet. <laughs> um yeah, it's got kind of Minecraft-ish feelings here. Structures that really shouldn't ever be able to exist. Are able to do it just fine. Alright, let's uh, build one conveyor belt out. Let's make it straight out. I'm wondering if I can set the conveyor belt up to the second floor. I think I have to set a... How would I 
How did I lift it before? I think you click and hold? Yeah. Alright, so let's... Maybe there. And then... If you can... It's too steep. Yeah, of course. that too steep? No. Is this too steep? Of course. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. I need to stop forcing this. Alright, let's, let's try something little different. So how do I get it from downstairs to upstairs? Well, I could start it immediately out of the Out of the container. I have a better feeling about this one. Better feeling. I think it's going to make it upstairs. There's one. Now can I do the same thing I did? <laughs> the same ugly thing I did. There. Stairs. Now, once we get this iron up here, it's still not going to be very easy. Because. So once you get the iron up here, it's still not going to be very easy um, because we're going to have to go make more power plants because I'm pretty sure we're already at the limit of our, our current power plants. So, um, is that no? Yeah, this is turning out to not be great. Still too steep, huh? What? That works? That can't be right.
Give me all the irons. Here, I wonder. Can I cheat? And do it up on this side? Technically, I can, but... Hmm. Oh, dang, I ran out of stupid iron plates again. Oi. gonna get this to work. I swear. Just maybe not today. Oh. none of those will work and that won't work and that won't work I got myself into a weird pickle here can I move this pole back one spot all right here we go a little bit of science or something how many spots do these have to go so that's one two before it's considered too steep that's one two Go. One, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, so there's one like placement spot, whatever. I don't know what you'd call it there, but okay, one is too steep. Or sorry, two is too steep. Three away is fine. Okay, that's good to know. So if I move in theory. If I put another one, one, two, three spots away, that should be a legal placement. Four? Maybe it's four. Maybe I miscounted. Okay, so... Yeah, that's good to know. It's four... roughly four spots away so here to here is fine now oh science all right um i'm thinking we might actually need a lookout tower nearby because i am going to have a lot of problems building over here without the vertical clearance Okay, so we want to build two constructors, both with, um, or one for bars and one for, actually no, let's see what kind of output or throughput we can get. So maybe we need four constructors. I'm going to start with two constructors each for Iron plates and iron bars, rods, rods. Production. Okay, we're gonna need a whole bunch of reinforced iron plates. Okay, so definitely made some progress. We are finally moving.
Okay, we're gonna need some reinforced iron plates, which is screws and rods, I believe. And screws are rods, so yeah, a whole bunch of rods should be good. Okay, so we're gonna need 12 reinforced iron plates. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Two, three, four. So yeah, this is the reason why I feel like handcrafting is so much faster. I mean, you can't argue with automation, but handcrafting is a heck of a lot faster, at least initially. Is just the time it takes up takes to set up a factory. I mean, even if you do the sloppy way, like I was doing before, just dumping them on the ground, still not super quick. This is taking forever, though. But I'm gonna chalk that a lot of that up to. Uh, what does that mean? Does that mean that I just have enough? That or well, thought I did. So we're gonna need a splitter there, and then I'm gonna need one, two, three, four of these, and I don't think we're getting all four fitting on here. So let's go build out my platform a bit. Yeah, this is gonna be ugly as sin. Wow. Approaching others' clearance. Oh, good. here. There we go. Yeah, we're gonna need some walkways soon. That's another one of the, the texts we can research. But by gosh, I'm gonna get this... <laughs> I'm gonna get these constructors set up. Do one, two, Ugh. just not a lot of space up here, and I don't think you can stack constructors, because that would be neat, but I can try. Can I build it? Yeah, I can't build it on top. We do it with storage. So we want two constructors, probably, oh, we can't, oh, okay, so I want to put four constructors up here and have them feed into two different um, storage containers, and so maybe we should build the storage containers first, so we can know how much space we need. So here's storage container one, and here's storage container two. So that will cover roughly what we need to do. From there, I want to have a merger, so you can merge two different, there we go. Of course, I put the storage containers backwards. Alright, there we go.
We're going to go to logistics, merger. So we want, yeah, there we go. There's one. I want to put it basically so it's like kissing the other guy. One, two, let's make sure they're connected. Oh, that's pretty good. All right, now we have to figure out how to get four constructors up here. And make sure that uh, they can <laughs> both feed into those two containers. Um, that's going to be very difficult. So let's do constructor. God, these things are big. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. I think we're going to have to build higher. Hmm. There's all that open space over there. That would be perfect for a factory floor. Maybe I shouldn't be going this way. Maybe I should be going that way. I think that's <laughs> what I'm going to do. Alright, whoops. How are we doing for... Okay, we got enough inventory space for now. I'm just hoping I don't happen upon some critter. Clearing, 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 clearing. And, of course, another lookout tower. Here we go. And nothing. Nothing. What a bummer. Alright. So. Concrete. Lucky I set that up a while ago. Alright, yep, that's enough for now. Hello, concretes. Why aren't you making anything? What happened? 
Whoa. What did I do? Did I disconnect something? I disconnected something, didn't I? Oh, no, I didn't disconnect something. I ran out of power? How did that happen? Oh, I probably ran out of fuel. Alright, well, fortunately I've got a bajillion leaves and I can make a, a whole bunch of biofuel, so... Okay, I'm... What is crude, crude oil? Where did I find that? That's nifty. Let's go drop off... That... That... Um... What is this? Iron ore? Yeah, let's get rid of that. Alright, I might have to take a break in a little bit, because I've been playing for almost three hours, and... Everyone needs breaks. There we go. Okay, I cleared up enough space to make a whole bunch of biomass. Actually, while I'm doing this, I should probably just put some fuel in all of these. Um, you can have that. Um, there we go. Get everything moving while we're diddling over here. One of the other automations that I should probably do soon is um, the biofuel automation. But I kind of hate doing that because, I mean, pretty quickly you get to the point where you don't need biofuel. So I'm hoping I'll make it there before that kind of automation is needed. No, that's enough. That is enough. I'm gonna... Take these two out of there. Drop the wood and the leaves. And then I'll take the limestone over to the concrete production. There we go. finish making this uh, first floor. Three, four. I can't build. I can build there. So the only one I can't build is right where that container is. So that's fine. entire factory doesn't look right so I'm not too worried. There we go. Can I get away with that? No, that's blocked. Okay, so let me see if I can get my foundation just a little bit farther. One, two, three. Alright, well, that should be 
Good, we can pump the iron out into one of these platforms. I think we're gonna need get a whole bunch more copper production because those wires actually why don't we do that right now because yeah we absolutely need a heck of a lot more wires okay let's see what we're doing here let's optimize the copper um 120 a minute so i think it's roughly the same as 30 per minute yeah so it's the same as the iron so we need four smelters Let me go see what the status of the iron or the copper is here. Oh, there's a ton. And I just realized I still have all that biomass in my um, inventory. So I'm going to come over here first. And uh, on this lonely platform right here, I'm just going to set up a. Biomass container. And then I will have it move right into a constructor. And then the constructor will make biofuel. And then I will have a biofuel container. How ugly can we make this? I bet you we can make it real ugly. I'm going to make it as ugly as possible. All right. So, on... <laughs> no, they're not that ugly. No. That yeah, should be fine. And then we need a... Power lines. Oh, I do like this tree right here, but it is going to get kind of in the way. Power wise, where are we? Oh yeah, we're, we're going to need another power plant. I'd rather get that done now. So power plant, and then let's go fix copper. Ah! No. Oh. Am I stuck down here? This is so stupid. What a dumb problem that I've got myself in. All right. Uh, ooh, that's not good. I maxed out on the number of power connections that power line can take. One more biomass burner.
How are we doing? 80. Perfect. All right, so probably you're going to need one or two more of those before we get to coal. But, you know, hopefully not too many more. And you, my unfortunate friend, have been stuck here for a while, just glitching. Let's just move you. There you go. Alright, so you're doing a bunch of biofuel. Okay, good. So, we should have some biofuel for a bit. Okay, now we're going to do copper, finally. Um, I'm sure we're going to run out of something. <clears throat> but, let's see what it would take to get four smelters down there. My other worry is, how full is this thing still? Yeah, it's still super full. And I don't think I have the space in my inventory to... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, maybe I do. And I'm guessing we can probably get, let's see, how many are you able to do? 45 per minute. Oh, is that right? Sounds about right. 45 wire per minute, but that's still, what, 15? Is that 15 or 9? Anyway, I feel like we can get a couple more constructors out of there, too. For now, though, let's just build some platforms and get our... Smelters up. One, two, three, four. Oh, yeah, I used all my gas. I'll go pick some up. Fortunately, we're making a bunch. Okay, um... We need two splitters. And did I leave myself enough room for that? Probably not. Get away, bush. Here, set up a splitter. And I ran out of cable finally. But I think, yeah, we have the crafting station here over, over here still. So, let's go make. 
some more wire. Then we can make some cable. Alright, that's enough. Copper is going in to there, and there. And we're going to need one more splitter right here. Seriously? Why is this not working? <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, of course. Oh, good. No, never mind. I can't afford it because I don't have any more iron uh, plates. That's a good, different problem to have. So we want to build power here, and then power here. All right, so we need to set them up to be okay yeah we can definitely run these given our current power needs all right what did that do to the power 40 50 yeah we'll probably need another power plant pretty soon. For now though we need to break down mostly let's just break down everything. Let's start maybe we can just add it to the factory floor over there. Oops. Wow that's a lot of wire. Okay, so we'll get the rest of the next part set up in a second, but we should get two storage containers. Goodbye, trusty workbench. Hello, trusty workbench. Yeah. Okay, cool. So, we're just going to build one storage container over here. And one over here. 
And we need some more rods. Which we have no more iron. So let's go fix that. Oh man, this is ugly. Oh man, that's ugly. I think I need to go dump off some of the stuff in my inventory. Actually, yeah, why don't we switch to personal storage? and plates. So we need a hundred rods and a hundred plates. And then we can start building chests. And that'll be neat. Okay, cool. Alright, there we go. And then drop the plates in. Personal storage. Now let's go back and. Uh, what was it? Part assembly? I think that's what we were sort of working on, but not really, but sort of. Um, is there a way to build. Oh, there we go. Personal storage. Um. I can build just a little foundation right here. There we go. And then I'll build a another personal storage chest. Importantly, my personal storage grew a little bit. It's good. Okay, so we need to f finish the. Alright, we need to make sure we have plenty enough concrete, iron, wait, why is this one so much lower? There's iron coming out of both of these, right? Oh, because this split is not a very good split. The split is doing one third this way and two thirds that way. Is there a non crappy way to. Yeah, I'm gonna need to fix that. Oh, 
Okay, so what we need to do first, spill, or we need to do three splitters. So, um, or at least this is my thought. So, this one, this one splitter right here. We'll do 50-50. And then what we want to do is we want to have one more splitter down here. Sorry, so 50 left, 50 right, yeah. So we'll do one right there. And then we'll do another one right there. Do that guy there. I don't think it really matters which one, but I can't see that side, so we'll make ugly there you go over there and then I think that's all I can do over here because I can't see Whoop. you're there cool that should be more even so that'll be a 50-50 split, and then this will be 50-50, so it's one quarter, one quarter of the final output of that miner as well as these two. So, there we go. Now we're going to have to get our bars and rods figured out. This is going to drive me crazy. How much concrete do I have in here? Not that much. Actually, wait. Where? What? Okay. And then we're going to take all this and we're going to run a whole bunch of stuff back to my chest. I guess we could have just built one there, but no. Okay. I don't need all this garbage. But I definitely don't need any of the ore. Or the leaves. Alright, there we go. How are my power plants doing since I'm up here? Oh! Real, real low. Or not enough, at least. So... Here, well, no, 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 yep. I'm gonna put another storage container there, and that'll be the concrete one. We'll go from here to there. Of course, it's too steep. Oh, but you can't go in there. No, you can't go there. Unfortunately, I think this is time for tree removal. No, oh, I really liked that tree. Seriously, that's still too steep? Are you kidding me? Alright, we'll go over there then. 
Let's see if we can spaghetti it up there. Is there a path that'll make that happy? Not yet. We'll make one. No worries. Um... Is there a path that'll make this happy now? Nope. This is so annoying. <laughs> oh. Alright, this is this is maddening. This is just driving me crazy. Encroaching what? 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 What is it encroaching? Just get up there. Ah. Oh no, I'm gonna have to do something stupid, aren't I? Yes, I am. It's not encroaching anything. Just get up there. All right, spaghetti. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. Forget it. Oh, no, not the pet, not the power line. Forget it. All right, um. We're gonna build storage right here. This be for all the concrete. And we're just gonna have it pop out of here. And feed right in there. Ugh. Oh. All right, back to what we were doing before. Man, I do not really keep a good solid train of thought when playing this game. All right. Let's try this again. Right there. Now we need a... Is there enough room here for a splitter? 
or a merger merger I'm sincerely I'm sincerely doubting it but we'll try Why am I working this hard? Let me just put the storage container right here. Here and set up the second one. <sighs> Merger. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's not going to work. So let's. Uh... down there see if we can figure out how to get it to work nicely Are you kidding me how is that not working No, I'm not going to sit here and fight this. I'm I'm just going to put the merger up on top of the platform up there. I don't need it to be pretty. I just need this one to work. So, it's not great, but it's working. This is working now. Crafting bench, duh. Okay, yeah, I think I'm getting a little tired. I think I need to take a break. So, I'm going to take a break right now. Save my game. And uh, I'll be back in a bit. <laughs> <laughs> 